Hi, I'm Noel, and this is my story. Now, as a beta male, a real introvert, how do you approach a girl that's a 10 out of 10? Now, that right there is a problem, because considering a girl a 10 out of 10, that's like putting women in a pedestal. You know, you don't do that. You know, I'm old enough now to know you don't do that. But when I was younger, let me tell you, this is what I did. Um, I used to travel a lot um, to different countries you know, earlier when I was younger. This time I went over down to the Dominican Republic and I was hanging out with my cousin who lives there. We decided to go watch a baseball game. I'm like, sure, let's go. And at this point I was bored of going down to the Dominican Republic. I said, this is my last trip. I ain't never coming back here. There's nothing for me. And that was the attitude that I had. I'm like, there's nothing here for me. We went to the baseball game, I stuck around for a couple of innings. Then after like three innings, I'm like, oh yeah, let's get out of here. I'm done, tired. And we start walking back to the car. As we walk back to the car, this girl approaches us, calling him down like she knew him. She's like, hey, hey, wait, wait, wait. And he waited for her. When she was getting close and close, I'm like, wow. This girl is actually pretty. Wow. I wonder if she's a great person, you know? And <laughs> look at me. What the hell am I thinking? And as she got closer to the car, I'm like, oh, wow. She really is pretty. Um, They started talking. And she's like, can you give me a ride home? Can I get a ride with you? And we're like, sure. Get in the car. Um, But first, we got to drop me off. Uh, This is my cousin. He introduced me, uh, Noel so-and-so like i wasn't even listening because you know a girl is pretty you don't want to embarrass yourself look at the thoughts that i had in my mind i'm like let me not say nothing stupid i'm gonna just stay quiet let me just see what's going on she gets in the back of the car i get in the passenger side and we drive to my mother's house <laughs> this whole time as we're driving to my mother's house she's like so hey and she's talking a mile a minute she's just talking to him blah 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 whatever and I'm just sitting there quietly, not saying a word. Um, at one point, she looks at him and she's like, so this is your cousin? Why he's so quiet? He don't talk? And I just looked at her and smiled like, didn't say a word, just quiet the whole ride all the way to my mother's house. And she's like, okay, whatever. He kept talking to him, blah, 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 blah. So in my mind, I'm thinking, okay, I need to say something. I need to shoot my shot. Like, I got to say something. But I couldn't think of anything. We get to my mother's house. Drive up. My mother's sitting in the porch in a chair talking to a friend. Um, we stopped the car. So I came up with a plan. We got out the car. As I get out the car, I said, hey, mom, I want you to meet my girlfriend. And she just didn't say nothing. I went around, I opened up the back door, grabbed her hand. Come on, let's go. Mom, this is my girlfriend. I want you to meet her. Her name is, but I forgot her name. And I looked at her, like, she said, so-and-so. She said her name. So she sat down next to my mother. My mother's looking at her like, okay, who's this? Hi. Okay, she's pretty. My mother's like touching her face. Like evaluating her like, okay, she's pretty. So I'm like, yeah, yeah. So we, we met, you know, earlier. Decided to go out. And we had a whole long conversation. So eventually we're going to get married and have a child. And I just said that. And then she just smiled like, okay. Sure. <laughs> So she never said anything like, hell no, who the hell is this guy? What are you, stupid? It's just too quiet. Um, but right now she needs to go to her house, okay? So she's like, yeah, okay, I got to go. Nice to meet you. And then they left in my cousin's car. And that was the end of that. Now, that's bad. You shouldn't be considering girls 10 out of 10. 
eventually we did end up going out. All right. We had a, we got married and had a baby. Crazy story, but that's another one. All right. Next time I'll share that story.